So, a while back, one of my friends gave me this awesome game called Pokemon Omicron, which is a completely free, fan-made version of Pokemon that includes Pokemon from all the regions up to black and white, and a couple of Mega Evolutions from X and Y. Um, if you're into Pokemon, it's a really awesome game, and you should try it out. But anyway, today, I've taken it and then given it a semi-animated icon on Mac. So when I say semi-animated, I mean it's not doing anything, but when you open it, the icon changes to an open Pokeball. And then the game opens. And then when you quit the game, Pokeball closes again. <coughs> So this is accomplished by using an automator app, which basically repackages a giant shell script and Apple script that move files around. And so basically inside this game, in the resources where the icon is supposed to be, there's a symbolic link, which is basically like an alias that tells the computer to treat it as though it was the file it links to. And those point to directory, not to specific um, file ID or whatever Apple uses to track where you move it. So it points to this folder. And then basically when you open it, it moves the open.icns into the current and renames it automator applet icon. And then when you close the game, it moves that in there. And so that changes it. Um, I'll just show you how that works. So if I paste this in here copy the name first, and if I like switch my desktop or something, it updates. So yeah, um, I also have an installer made so that it will move the images into a hidden directory on your disk, so it's always at the same location for the script to use. So you can use this on your computer if you have Pokemon, but this is sort of a proof of concept. Um, I'm going to try and take my installer and make it so it works for any application and doesn't just require you to have Pokemon Omicron. Like, I'm going to try and make it so that you can tell it what application you want and give it the icons. But um, when that's finished, I'll tell you. Until then, um, the link to the Pokemon Omicron website along with the download for the icon installer will be in the description. So thank you for watching. Also, as a final thought, um, my intro would be a lot better with music, so if any of you have any ideas of royalty-free music um, so that I don't get sued and my intro will sound better, please leave your suggestions in the comments. Um, thanks, that's all.